What's going on everybody, Captain Horn 23 here and today I'm going to show you how to install the Realistic Headlights mod for LSPDFR. Don't forget to join my LSPDFR and X-Plane 11 community discord. In here I have many channels related to LSPDFR including 4 help channels with helpers standing by to assist you with any issue you may have with LSPDFR. I also have X-Plane related channels where you can come in here and talk with other people that play X-Plane and make new friends and you can also go on group flights and VAT sim with your friends. I will also be going on group flights with people, so if you wish to fly with me, or even play LSPDFR with me, feel free to join the Discord. I'm always looking for new members, the link to join the Discord will be in the description. So guys, the realistic headlights does exactly what you would expect it to do. It uh, makes your headlights look a lot more realistic, more bright, and all of that. And it's a super simple install. All we need today is this realistic headlights vehicles.oiv here on my desktop. As always, the link to download it will be in the description. Once you click the link, it'll bring you to this page here. And um, you can read about it and uh, what it does. I mean, it's pretty obvious what it does. I mean, just look at the picture. Make sure the lights look really good. All you want to do is hit download and then hit the second green download button and drag it up to your desktop like I have right here. Next, what we want to do is open OpenIV. And of course, we select Grand Theft Auto 5 for Windows. And once it's up and running like this, we can hit tools right here beside help. Go down to package installer right above run Grand Theft Auto 5. Click package installer. And then if it's not already on your desktop, click on desktop over here on the left side menu. And simply double click this realistic headlights vehicles.oiv. And after that, you want to hit install. And then always hit into mods folder. Never hit game folder, always hit mods folder. And once you hit that, you hit install and confirm installation. And now if you don't have that mods folder, all you got to do is go up to tools, ASI manager, and install all three of those and you will have a mods folder. But you also want to drag in your update and time 64 folders into there. I have other video tutorials on doing that, so feel free to reference those. And once you're done with that, you can X out of that and delete this or do whatever you wish with that. And that is literally it, guys. So now once you go in the game, you are going to have some really good looking headlights. Um, so that's going to do it for today's video guys as always don't forget to join the discord if you need any help with anything or to just join a fun community to hang out with and talk with other LSPDFR players and some Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 players, x -Plane players, all of that and don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you guys on the next video I hope you guys have a great rest of your day